Leonora Overture No. 3 is probably one of the greatest orchestral pieces ever written. Tonal beauty and control are of great importance in creating a mood of intimacy and quiet anticipation in the adagio of this most dramatic orchestral piece. In the opening bars, don't let the vibrato overpower the delicate tone. The first four measures of this solo say so much about a player's control over the tone. In a good performance, all the elements of tonal control are in evidence. Beauty of sound, control of pitch and vibrato, and the ability to spin out a musical line in a simple scale. Tonal control continues to be an element in the ascending triplet passages where the sound on every note should be equal in beauty and delicacy to the note before, regardless of the register. In bars 19 and 20, connect the two F sharps without a break and with a gentle tongue on the downbeat F sharp. Continue this gentle tonguing on the triplets that follow. The opening solos in the Leonore Overture are very introspective in nature. This solo is more extroverted and requires a very brilliant performance with rhythmic stability, clear articulation, and tonal intensity until the final sustained D. For that last sustained D, your note is part of a chord and is not thematic material. It is very important to play with a very light vibrato or no vibrato at all. Thank <laughs> you. 